Hello everyone. So, um, I'm going to be doing a showcase of Xena Miner of all the stuff I've done. Uh, this is even in squirrel voice because, you know, reminiscing of such. So this was my first base that I had. Uh, I'm just screwing around in it, looking at the lights. Uh, and then I, and I do this, check it out, watch. As I, as I shut the door and I think that the lights are going to turn off, I was wrong. That's not what turns it off. Look, look, that's what turns it off right there. Oh my goodness. Uh, it's, it's turning it off. Yeah, now I'm back on. It's so great. And then it turned off again. Oh my goodness. And then I open the door. All right, good. Good. We're moving in the right direction here. I, I go down this hallway in my old base. Uh, I show you that there's nothing there because that's what you like to look at is nothing. Because uh, I'm an asshole. Condescending. Uh, here is my observatory. Uh, no, no, go back in. Yeah, good job past me. You went, you went back in. All right, going up. Uh, yeah, all right, mm -hmm, yeah. So this is past. This is in the past recording. I am, I decided it was pointless for me to try to record. Uh, recording live is a bit of a pain. Well, not live, but with the, uh, the video. Recording the audio with the video is a bit of a pain because I have to, like, move wires around to do it. So I'm, I'm speaking after I record it now. Uh, just to let you know. So here's another part of my old base. This is a showcase. This is a showcase, everyone. Here's where their, their computer thing would have been. Uh, because, you know, I always have, like, a computer room. Uh, and here's, here's this place. Uh, it kind of looks like a missile launch place from the top. Uh, I was wondering how to get up, because those doors right there are supposed to be open, and I had no idea. Uh, but fortunately, I cut out me waiting around like an idiot, and got to the part where I, uh, just started going through the ceiling. Uh, so, you know, I'm gonna go, come on, man, there's a bunch of layers. Okay, good. So, this, there, that opens it. Uh, but it should already have been open, and it would shut when the top door opens. Uh, but I don't know, somewhere along the line, it got buggy, and they were all closed. So here's a little missile launch silo thing. There it opened there. Now I'm gonna cut. Gonna, okay, good. Now I'm at my newer base. Well, my primary base. Uh, it's where I showed off like all the new features for the updates. Uh, here's missing door. That's nice. Uh, all right. Mm -hmm. There's the door. I showed people how to use the door here uh, in the door tutorial, which is great. I love it. Uh, I go down. And this is where I did some of my like Xenominer trailers that I had. I might show you. I might show you some of it during a cut maybe. So here's where the supercomputer is, i.e. Daisy. This is it's supposed to be Daisy, this blue screen thing that I'm not looking at. There, that. That blue screen thing. That was supposed to be Daisy. Like a supercomputer. I'm um, turning off the lights. Look, see, look, you can see them. The lights are off. Kind of hard to tell because there's still lights in the room. So it's not as fancy as it could have been. All right. Good. Uh, so it's really creepy. I, I wanted Xenominer to seem a bit creepy in the trailer, which is why I have all the lights off. Like, originally, the lights were all on. Look, there I did it again. I clicked the door thing, expecting the lights to do something. I'm an idiot. All right, there. That's the light switch. Look at them all come on one by one. It's amazing. They weren't actually coming on one by one. It's just the timing of the door panel would, like, make them look like they were going off one by one. Uh, all right, and then this turns all the lights off at once. All right, okay, so there, that's it. I really should have cut this part. This is taking forever. Oh, my God, what's wrong with me? All right, okay, good. Now, as I'm going to do it again, I'm going to show you there's nothing behind this door. Uh, all right, good. I have a lot of those. I like to make things look bigger by placing doors around and then never going in them, when really there's nothing there, and I love it. I love that. It'll fool people. I like it. I like fooling people. I like. I should be a magician because uh, they like to fool people, too. Bastards. Always tricking me. Fucking witch. All right, here, so this pissed me off. I was trying to make, like, an engine room, like, where it was all orange and warm looking, like, there were some kind of engines burning. Uh, but because of the weird bug where, like, things, like, uh, see-through things don't work together, that didn't work. And now here is my Tron world. This is where I did a Tron world thing. Yep, it's real colorful and nice. Uh, the reason why the dirt is like this is because I would pave over it with the Tron world, and I got rid of the rest of the Tron world because I needed... Why am I saying Tron world? That's getting annoying. Uh, but, yeah, so here it is. Here's inside the building. I had some stuff here because I needed to, like, carry a bunch of stuff around this area. But, yeah, I, I, like, got rid of a lot of the Tron world to use for something else that you'll see later. Here's the corrupted part. I really like the tree thing, though. The tree over there. Yeah, that was nice. Pixel art time. Powerpuff Girls. Right here. Oh, yeah. Uh, then there's Fluttershy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, great. Uh, then Rainbow Dash. How lovely. Uh, here was a creeper. I got rid of the green in it because I, I had to make something else with it. And you're gonna see what that is soon. Uh, here it is. Here it comes. Oh, there's Gur. Gur. I needed to use the green to make Gur. He came out pretty nice. Uh, another pony, obviously. Uh, Princess Luna, I thought, I'm on the moon. Might as well have Princess Luna, because she's on the moon. Uh, because Princess Celestia's a jerk. So this is what I used a lot of the Tron stuff for. I had to, like, get rid of it. Because I, I realized the Tron world isn't a bunch of squares. It's not, no. There's still a, a lot of squares, though. But, uh, you know, I saw the new movie uh, with Daft Punk in it. Because, oh, Daft Punk's the best. Uh, but uh, I saw the new movie. And I'm like, you know what? That's what the Tron world looks like. And I decided I was going to try to make another Tron world. I never finished it. Uh, so, yeah, that's pff, shame. Shame. Never finished a lot of stuff. I was expecting to go up when I was standing in the corner there like an idiot, but here is where the real up corner is, uh, which is great. A uh, bunch of other rooms and shit. I don't know what I was doing. I fell down the hole. Uh, yep, mm -hmm. yeah, great. Yeah, okay, moving on. I said moving on. Past me. Move on. There we go. Okay. So, uh, this is my biggest build yet. Oh my god, this took forever. Uh, the gerbil tube. Uh, it was designed so you could walk upside down and it would look exactly the same. I mean, you would see the dirt above your head, I, below your head, whatever, gravity, uh, so this is where I, like, looked at some of the newer features, like, uh, like the new gravity push block things and the air filters and, and, uh, 
Psst, look, there's Terrence. Uh, all right. So yeah. Yeah. Hmm. I guess I had to refill my air. Damn. I'm here for a long time. Well, okay, so the way I was planning on doing it was I was gonna have lights everywhere, and I knew how I wanted that corner to be done. I never did it. I wanted there to be, like, colorful lights everywhere, to be, like, a kind of district. Like, look, this is where the red city is, this is where the green city is, that's where the blue city is. Uh, never, like, there were gonna be cities inside the bigger bulb areas of the tubes. Um, but, yeah, you know, the reason, like, you're probably thinking, oh, that's not a big thing. I've seen bigger. I don't work with anyone. I am too picky. Oh, but here, here's a place. Uh, so, this was gonna be for a trailer I was planning on making. Like, it was meant to be, like, a spaceship. Like, you're in a spaceship, but, uh, I'm not in a spaceship. I am on the ground, because there are no spaceships in this game. But I was gonna make it look like I was in a spaceship by never showing the outside. However, there are a few holes, so that would have been filled with, like, a door or whatever. Look, more doors, because I like to trick people into thinking that's bigger than it is. So the way this trailer was gonna work was I was gonna wake up out of my bed, notice that my roommate wasn't there, and just walk around and notice a few things, like the lights are off over there, for example. Like, some of the places, like, destroyed, where is everyone, yada yada. Uh, I would have noticed... No, fuck this. Forget this. I, listen, I got something to show people. Past... Past Johnny. Stop. Okay, so I'm gonna go and show you the lights. There, there's where the lights are. Hooray, I love this look with the lights on the ground. So, here is where, like, a hole was. Like, something bit out of the, uh, the side of the ship. And I was supposed to be like, oh, look, this is where the Venators were hanging out or whatever. I was gonna add some, like, Venator stuff, I think. Like, some of their nest stuff. Uh, but yeah. So, that's that. I'm still here. Gonna show a bit more. Uh, see, like, I would've just covered the holes with, like, doors and stuff, so. That would've all been fixed. Here's another room. The lights, there are no lights in this room to, like, turn on. Uh, alright. So, yeah, I didn't finish this one. Oh, well. But yeah, you know, it was gonna be for a trailer. Never, never finished it. Never, yeah, a lot of things. Alright, so here is where my Let's Play place was. Uh, this is where I kept the Venators, because I wanted to, like, keep some as pets. There was Vinny, and, and other ones, Miss, Miss, Mrs. Biscuits, and Mr. Kibbles. That's it. Vinny, Mrs. Biscuits, and Mr. Kibbles. The three Venators that would show up. Look, there's some more. Hooray. Yay. Uh, so, yeah, I never, I, I don't know. A lot of these things never have, like, an end goal in mind. Like, I'm just building, building, like, hallways, hallways, rooms, hallways, rooms. Uh, I, I, I don't know. Uh, so I cl that, that room looked ugly anyway, whatever. So here's red and blue. Uh, I just kind of created them because I was like, whatever. I'll make some, like, people-looking things. And I did. Uh, I wanted to make this building here. This is all in the same world, by the way. The same, uh, Let's Play world. Uh, I wanted to show off the grates here. Which is why I built this above ground. But then I noticed this, and I was like, God damn it. Uh, and here is my newer Let's Play world. Uh, with Terrence in it. Here is where the base used to be. I got rid of it all. Uh, and here comes Terrence. We're gonna show you Terrence now, everyone. I heard a, I heard a Venator, so I looked around all scared and got my gun out. Uh, here's Terrence right there. I love him. I hump him a bit. Oh, yeah. Good old loving. Loving fashion style. Yep. Ah, shit. I should've cut this part out. Like, the other parts where I say, I should've cut this out, I, I, I knew to, left, to leave it in so I could have more space to talk. But this part, I was actually supposed to cut out. I didn't. Oh, no. Alright, let's see where I go with this. So here is what I was doing. I was trying to make kind of another Tron world, but a little different. It was going to be all weird looking, and there was going to be a green ground and red and blue bases. All right, so that's it.